Uh, hi, I'm Weston. I love talking about the Rangers, and I'm here to talk about game one of the second round versus the Carolina Hurricanes, where the Rangers lose in overtime 2-1 to one to the Hurricanes. And that was painful. That was so painful. That, that, that hurts to my very deepest part of my soul. Okay. This game just sucked. Because, my God, you were that close. That close to winning the game and taking a one nothing series lead in the first game in Carolina. And it would have... You were so close. All right. This does not need more than, like, one take. This, this is... Oh, it's painful because this is not a lot to talk about. First goal, Rangers, first period, before the halfway point. Beautiful takeaway by Alexi Lafreniere. Great job by him to intercept the pass. The kid's line looks great, guys. It's incredible. Beautiful steal by Lafie. He carries into the offensive zone, and he is just so patient with the puck. He waits and waits and waits and waits, and my goodness gracious, did he wait perfectly. Sets up Philip Heedle. He buries it. A beautiful goal by Heedle to bury it. A beautiful pass and set up by Loppy. A beautiful goal. And it's one nothing Rangers and you're like, alright. But it's one nothing. Like we took the first lead. And you're a little bit flabbergasted. And then the rest of the first period takes away. And the Rangers are the overwhelmingly better team. They just look infinitely better. And the second period happens. And again, we might even look better than the first. For 40 minutes the Rangers crushed the hurricanes under our thumb like a grape. They looked great. They were fantastic. And then the third period happened, and the Hurricanes walked us like a dog for the last 20 minutes of the third and the, what, like three minutes of overtime? It was horrific for the Rangers. Uh, I think shots were only somehow 10 to 4 in the third period, which is bonkers to me because it felt like it was 28 to nothing. I mean, they outshot us... Felt like they outshot us to hell. They possessed it in our zone for the entirety of the first, like, ten minutes. I don't think we had a shot on goal till over halfway through the third period. It was horrific for the Rangers. It was, you'd battle in our zone for a minute. You'd eventually get the puck played into their zone for maybe three seconds, but it would just be a dump in to get a line change. And it was rinse and repeat that for the entirety of the third period. Kane's got some really good chances. Shesterkin looked great this evening, especially in the third. He made some massive saves. Uh, there was a save. It was a... Granted, the puck hit the post. I think Shesterkin got a little fraction of a piece of it. I think he did on a breakaway. You look great. The only goal in regulation, Kane's score, Sebastian Ajo set up by Seth Jarvis. Ajo, really nice move. Shesterkin, great save. No one there to help him get the rebound. Ajo puts in his own rebound. It's 1-1 with less than three to play, and you were that close, that close to... Taking the first game, stealing it, to stealing the first game. I'm going to completely gloss over the fact that Capococco completely whisked on a, whiffed on a wide open net in this uh, third period late, which would have iced it. Could have iced it! Caco, like, that was wide open. And I've been nice to the kids' line, but boy, that was... That was the first, like, jaw-dropping gaff by the kids' line. And you go into overtime, Ian Cole nothing shot on net, a nothing shot. It's not even heading towards the net. And it is tipped in by Ryan Lingrid. And, hey, I mean, Lingrid scored the game-winning goal. I just wish it wouldn't have been for the other team, which is the real issue of that goal. And I actually saw a few Rangers fans mad at Shesterkin on that goal thing, saying, that's a nothing shot. It's got no velocity to it. And I'm like, guys... I, I really think you're missing something here. The shot that put it in the net wasn't by an opposing player. It was by his own defenseman. And Ryan Lingard, who has been so great in these playoffs, he was great in game one of the first round. He was great when he came back in the last few games of the first round. He was great defensively tonight, battling through another entry. He just kept on grinding and then makes that mistake. And it was just, just horrific. And you drop game one. And a lot of Rangers fans are losing their minds about this game. And I just gotta say, guys, calm down. It's the Hurricanes. We knew they were a great team. We knew this was not going to be an easy series. The fact that you played 40 minutes where you so thoroughly kicked their asses is pretty darn impressive. You clearly are capable of doing it. The defense looked incredible in the first 40 minutes. 
fell apart in the third. But they can clearly shut down the Hurricanes. The offense had so many chances. You got goalied by Antti Ranta. How many great saves did he make tonight? Like, he played great. Your offense was working. Granted, you know, one goal that you see that and you go, oh, the offense was pretty bad. No, no, no. The offense was good. Just got goalied by Antti Ranta. Shesterkin is incredible. The pieces are there. You can do it. You'd really like to win Friday and not go down 0-2 in the series before you head back to Madison Square Garden, but this is still a very winnable series. I don't see this game and think, wow, we got kicked up and down the ice for, you know, 60 minutes. This wasn't like the Rangers got a lucky goal and then Shesterkin just bailed us out into overtime, kind of like what Bennington did yesterday. This was the offense and defense looked good for 40 minutes and then the defense fell apart. And the offense couldn't get anything going in the third. And same goes for overtime. The pieces were there. You can do it. But boy, oh boy. I would just, for the next two days until the next game, replay the third period. Just loop that 20 minutes in the film room. Just loop it. And make everyone sit there and watch it. Because that was horrific. So game two of the series is Friday, 8 p.m. Eastern. And I'll be here afterwards. So thank you all so very much for watching. I hope you all have an absolutely fantastic day. And as always... Go Rangers.